Hey friends, I want you to get ready for a very satisfying whole house deep clean with me today. I cleaned all day long for eight hours. It was broken up throughout the day because my house was a complete disaster. I just woke up. I was ready to get going, ready to get moving and clean up the real life messes that we have in our home. You're going to see me get down and dirty and get all of those little places clean. And I wanted to make for sure every single spot of my house was sparkling clean. Wait till you see some of these messes that I'm going to be cleaning today and it's going to be super, super satisfying. I can guarantee that at the end of this video, you're going to be ready to get up and get moving. So sit back, watch me clean, and then let's get ready to get things done. This way, but it's not that easy. You're complicating things for me. No, it's not that easy. So, lately, with the change in the weather, it's been getting warmer outside. The sun is out more often. And so, we have been spending a lot of time together as a family and just spending time outside on the weekends, which means the house has been getting neglected throughout the weekend. So it was a new day, a new week, and I was ready to get this house cleaned after a fun-filled weekend. I was dedicating the entire day to cleaning. Of course, I was going to be cleaning on and off throughout the day as I take care of my kids, but I just got started in the kitchen and the living room, just picking things up, putting things where they go. And you'll also be seeing a big mess in the basement. I planned on cleaning blinds, scrubbing the bathtub in the shower, the one bathtub was full of dirt from the kids and all of their outdoor fun throughout the weekend. I was going to be scrubbing grout, cleaning bathrooms. I am telling you, I was doing it all today and getting this complete disaster of a house cleaned up. If you've never been to Jamie's Journey, my YouTube channel before, thanks for finding one of my videos and taking time out of your busy day to watch it. I truly hope that when you come to my channel, you feel motivated and inspired to get things done. Or maybe I just put a smile on your face. Either way, I hope you enjoy watching my videos. I make videos every single week here on my channel, a lot of cleaning, organization, deep and satisfying cleaning videos, and just more of my life my mom life. I would love to have you join. I would love to have you join my journey. I'm a mom of three young girls trying to keep it together and not lose my mind. Please think about subscribing. You can hit that red subscribe button and the notification bell next to the subscription button so you get notified of every video that I post. And let me know who you are and something about yourself. Just introduce yourself to me if you're new. Typically in the summer, we don't spend a lot of time in the basement, but since the kids are staying at home pretty much all of the time now, we need to switch up where we're playing, you know, just for the sake of 
not being in the same room over and over. Especially for the twins, they really need a change of scenery and we aren't taking them out in public yet. So we end up just bringing them down to the basement to play. And this was a mess that I needed to clean up desperately. I don't know why, but there's something just satisfying about cleaning up the basement. A lot of you know this is where I like to work out, get my workouts in. And when I come down here, it just feels good seeing a clean space while I'm getting a good workout in. You guys should definitely come over and find me on Instagram. I post more about my life, more about my girls and all of that. So come over, find me. It's Jamie Lynn's with an S dot journey. It's also linked below. I'm just an accident way to do How are you guys doing right now? I am personally so ready for summer. I am happy that it's almost here. It finally has become warm here in Ohio and we are loving getting out of the house when the sun is shining and it's warm. I instantly feel more energized and happier when I see that it's sunny out. So I've been loving the weather and it just puts me in a much better mood. But just let me know how you guys are doing. So next, I came upstairs while the twins were still napping to get some things done on the main living area, and I wanted to vacuum under the couches first and foremost, which I haven't done in a while, and then I was going to clean the windows and the blinds. And I have this nice little handy tool for cleaning blinds that I've been using, and I got it off of Amazon. I'll have it linked down below. And I just feel like no matter how often I clean the blinds, which is not very often, I'll admit that because I hate doing that, they're always so dusty and dirty and then as far as the windows i've been cleaning those now more that it's warm out and we have the blinds open and the windows open and it's just nice to look out the window and see a clean window so i've been cleaning them more frequently and if you're wondering what i'm using to clean the windows i was using my jaws glass cleaner i'll have the link down below if you want to try it out but it's just nice because i know right now you can't find a lot of cleaning products and every time i go to reorder my jaws cleaning products they always have stuff in stock but i'll have the link below if you want to check them out
you're not going to see me clean every inch of my blinds it just took way too long and i thought it would be boring for you to see me clean every inch of the blinds so i was kind of jumping around and editing parts out It was time to wash our sheets so i ran upstairs really quickly to throw our sheets and bedding in before i finished up some more deep cleaning in the living room and the kitchen I am just using the Mrs. Myers multi-surface spray in the mint scent. It's just a very fresh and light scent I like using just for certain things or areas in my household. And our cupboards had a lot of fingerprints on them, a lot of greasy fingerprints. And I hope, you know, I guess talking about how many fingerprints, which I know you guys can't really see everything, but I hope when you come to my channel that you see real life messes. I am a busy mom and I know we're all busy in our lives. So I hope that you don't see perfection. You see real life messes. You see me make mistakes. I am not perfect at all, but that's okay. I hope you see and feel welcomed here on my channel. We're in this together and I just hope that we can be friends. I hope I can help you out in some way. We all need to stick together. We all need help in some aspect of our lives and I just always want to make you feel welcome. I always want to make for sure that when I talk to you guys about cleaning, you see me cleaning and I, I'm honest with you. You know, I'm you're, you're seeing me clean all day today. This is certainly not every day or even every week. I try, but that's not how life goes. You know, you're seeing one day out of my entire week. So please don't compare yourself to what you see here. We all have different days. We have some days where we feel good. We have up days. We have down days. We have productive days. We have non-productive days. So keep all of that in mind. And ultimately, I'm glad you're here.
put out of the fire if it gets too dark. Oh, I'll be. To wipe down my countertops, I'm using my DIY cleaner that I mix up myself. It is one part rubbing alcohol, one part water, and then about a teaspoon of Dawn dish soap. And honestly, all of the ex exact ingredients aren't really that important. I don't measure them out. Um, I just kind of eyeball it, and I've realized that you know, typically one or more of the ingredients is not that big of a deal. Um, the only thing is you want to make for sure you don't have too much dish soap or your surface will be very soapy. But other than that, water, alcohol, um, not a big deal. But the alcohol content helps disinfect. It leaves my countertop super shiny and I just love using it all over my house. It's really and truly a great product. To wipe down most of my bathroom, I'm using the combination of the Jaws Disinfectant Cleaner and then the Jaws Granite Cleaner. I love the way the granite cleaner smells. It's just very light, a very light scent, but it's there, which puts a nice light scent in the air. And I know that they've been doing a really good job. Jaws has been doing a good job of keeping the disinfectant spray in stock. And you know, right now it's really hard um, to find disinfecting products. So again, if you wanna check them out, you can use the link in the description and the coupon code. Um, but yeah, I think now's a great time to check them out. To clean my grill, I'm using the Resolve Foaming Carpet Cleaner, and I've had a lot of you guys message me saying you've tried this to clean your grout, and it did an amazing job, which makes me so happy. You know, when I recommend a product that you guys also love it as well. It just makes me feel good, so thanks for letting me know. But all you have to do is spray it on the grout. You let it sit for a little bit. Usually it's only about 20 minutes for me, um, but if your grout is you know, really dirty, you might want to let it sit a little bit longer, but then you can just kind of um, scrub it with like a toothbrush or something and then wipe it down and you have clean grout. I got your letter, guess this is better. You win sometimes, lose sometimes, no need to apologize. It was the distance. We have between us It broke us down in disguise No need to apologize ooh, 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 ooh. But I can help that I miss you now And I need to reminisce this cause ooh, 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 ooh. We're still at our moments and before I moved on to our dirty bathrooms I wanted to pick up the twins room and then Avery's room really quickly 
I can't help that I miss you now. I can't help that I miss you now. So the girls' bathroom was actually really messy and dirty. There's definitely a difference between messy and dirty, and it was messy and it was also dirty. Did you see all of that dirt in the tub? I honestly wasn't going to clean this bathroom today because I had just cleaned it a few days before, but it obviously needed to be done. I guess that's what happens when you're just having fun in the summer. I was so grateful to have my Jaws cleaning products on hand because I've been having a really hard time finding bathroom cleaning supplies, specifically just bathroom. I don't know if you guys have been having the same issue. Every place I go to seems to be sold out, so that's been really frustrating. I also like using the Lysol Hydrogen Peroxide Bathroom Cleaner. You guys have probably seen me use it a ton here on my channel, and I cannot find it anywhere. I know a lot of people say they don't like getting cleaning products online. They just like to be able to buy some from the store, and I kind of like keeping different cleaning products around. So some I get it from online from like Grove or Jaws, but also I like to keep some basic stuff on hand. But every time I go to Walmart or to Target, they are completely sold out online and in store. So this is a time where I am grateful for the online cleaning products. After I cleaned the girls' bathroom, I wanted to give our bathroom a really good deep clean. I was planning on giving our shower a deep clean by using that Rubbermaid power scrubber on all of the tracking doors in there, and I honestly hate cleaning our master shower. I don't do it every single week, and I definitely don't deep clean it every time I clean it, if that makes sense. But today was one of those days I was really going to be cleaning that shower. So I was going to spray it down, let the product sit a little bit and work its magic while I went and cleaned the toilet, and then I was gonna go back and clean the tub.
having a good time, ain't doing no harm. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. Hey now, honey, I've been driving around in my car, looking for some kind of open bar. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. Got no money, but I'll work it out with my charm. Having a good time, ain't doing no harm. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. I got this power scrubber from Target. I'll have it linked below, but it just makes it's so much easier getting into a lot of the nooks and crannies that are hard to reach. And I feel like every time I use it in an area in my household, which I use it all over, mainly in the bathrooms and the kitchen, it's just so satisfying to see everything that it cleans out from those little nooks. Here I'm using Rain-X window and glass cleaner to clean the glass door, which is an amazing product for the shower door specifically because the glass cleaner part of it actually cleans the door, but then I have the Rain-X in it, which helps repel water from sticking to the glass door and it keeps it cleaner for longer. I'll have this product linked down below if you want to check it out. So I had finished up the afternoon cleaning session during the girl's second nap of the day because they're still napping twice a day. And then after they went to bed, I did my nightly cleaning routine of making sure everything was picked up, which it already was because Mike had cleaned up after dinner. So everything was already cleaned up except for vacuuming and mopping, which I always like to do at the end of the night. It's kind of relaxing to me, which I know is a little bit weird. But with the twins crawling around and having their hands on the floor and also picking up everything on the floor and putting it in their mouths, I've kind of been becoming a fanatic about keeping the floors clean. So I always vacuum and mop every single night. i 
But that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you found it motivating. I hope you will go and just get at least one thing done. Maybe you want to do a lot more than one thing, but just aim for one thing. I know you can do it. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. I've been getting messages from a lot of you saying you're not getting notified of my videos. So make sure you have the notification bell turned on. Come find me on Instagram and I will see you next time.